<clears throat> wow, we're at the end, Bailey. Christ. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna level up my Pokemon while you get your ass kicked. <laughs> Tonight, Gavin joins the hunt. Dear, oh dear, what was it? The hunt, the blood, or the horrible dream? Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm scared. <laughs> well, at least waited. <laughs> I'm trying to be a respectful guy, come on. Bro, old guy got hands, bro. What the fuck? You wait till he poops with that shotgun. <laughs> The music in this is really good. Bitch. What? It's so cheap, bro. Can you parry him? Yeah. Bro. Oh, jeez. What? You need the bolt hunter's mark, do you? You can just not go to New Game Plus. What happened? I'm pretty sure it just gives you the option to be like, do you want to go to New Game Plus? And you can just say no. I don't think so. No? Cauliflower Kid in my hunter's dream. For the first time ever. Wait, where'd you go? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Alright, hello, this is the doll. How you doing? Yo, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> they make you sweat a little. Try this again. Hello, gammon. Tonight. Bro. I felt like with Kaz, um, it was the first boss fight that we were both, like, actively fighting. Because most yeah. of the time, like, I'm not gonna lie, you do carry most of the fights. Mm. Um, but I felt like with Kaz, we were both struggling. Bro! Ow, asshole. Oh, what Ooh. the? I didn't even think I got him there. Phase two. Shit.
There he's teleporting. What is he doing? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what, what was going on? <laughs> <laughs> the last quarter of his HP bar, it was just like he accepted his fate. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Fucking hell. <laughs> now in this cutscene, why does your why does the character like extend his hand like he knows the moon prisons? Um, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you why once we kill it. Okay. I heard moon presence is kind of easy, but it does like a e AOE attack. Yeah, be careful. Oh shit. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't AoE attack rate right? it hits you um to hits you on one HP. Right, Bailey, I got this. I got this, Bailey. Let me do this. Oh, I'm just gonna throw grenades at it, Dom. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, 99 insight. Let's go. I, I, I legit healed twice. I have 18 blood vials. <laughs> that was the easiest that's ever been. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, that was really underwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> Are you watching my cutscene? No, I've, 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 I've been booted. No. I have now a great one. Okay, so the reason... So, the, what the Moon Presence is, it says the one that made the Hunter's Dream. So, mm. the, so the same way, like, um, Koz owns the Nightmare of... Um, well, the Nightmare of Hunter's Nightmare. And the Nightmare of Mensis is produced by... Uh, Murgo's Wet Nurse. Okay. This is Moon Presence's area, and German is Moon Presence's slave, in essence. He can't leave because the Moon Presence ties him to this place. So once you killed German, the new Moon Presence wanted someone new to, well, to sit in the Hunter's Dream to lore and war hunters. Um, okay. Which is what it tried to do, which is why your character extended your hand out, is because when it already enraptured you, it already made you its slave. Oh, shit. But via the way of the umbilical cords, you were able to resist it and, well, fight back. If you didn't have your umbilical cords, you would have just became his slave. Yeah. And became, well, the new German. So that's why in the second, um... The fuck? Someone in the, in the credits, his name is Marcos Dominetz. <laughs> 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 Bailey's just giving me, like, this big lore dump, and I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, so I remember, like, in the second ending, you're in a wheelchair, right? Yeah, so, it, like I said, it, it, it makes you its servant, basically. Hmm. So you become the new German, you just sit in the hunter's dream for ages. Fucking hell. Oh, shit. Okay. Alright, let me see. Skip. And the, the other ending is just like, well, you just leave. Yeah, I kind of like that ending, not gonna lie. Skips you two bosses, too. Mm. You're gonna have standard blood points. Wow. Goddamn. Yeah, it didn't give me an option to, you know, go back, but... Wait, hold on, let me see. Where am I going? When you load it in, it should, make me, it should say something like New Game Plus. Unless I haven't killed German on this save. Hold on, let me just go check, see if I have a German here. 
The mic, I, no, no, I'm back at the. Me. I'm back at the clinic now. Oh really? Damn! Yeah, yeah. I thought they would give you the chance. I guess you get. Yeah, don't want to kill German. <laughs> oh, that means you. Oh, that means your dude's lost. Oh. What? No, your guy in Ludwig's boss arena. He's gone. Oh man. Oh, that fucking sucks. No, because yeah, I have just checked. Oh, we need. Oh. <laughs> Do you know what that means? What? We have to go through the entire fucking game again if we want to do the stupid chalice dungeons. Oh, what? Yeah, because we have to, like... I'm pretty sure we have to go through the entire game again. Let me have a check. I can check that like, real quick, actually. Maybe you still have all the stuff, and maybe maybe we don't need to, but... Because but no, you'll be in New Game Plus anyway. Oh, I didn't... No, I have three chalices. You do, you have all the chalices. I have the Pathermu, Ailing Loran, and Great Is. So, so it's, so it's, um, Fumarian. There we go. Okay, Christ, that takes so long. It's good, I guess, use some of my other characters. Rosario, oh, I remember Rosario. Hello. Hello. Good evening. I'd give you a... Oh, of course. From one new game plus to another, I'm now a distinguished member of the Bloodborne Society. I wonder how much time... Cauliflower Kid was doing about five... 568 with each of his hits. Let me see what I do with this character. Damn, I just one shot at them. And I did say we'd be a bit. A bit bruised. Be a bit, um, yeah. Shit. Okay, good. Oh. That looks unique. Yeah, it is, yeah. Ooh, unlocked. Those are Fumarian, well, they're just Fumarians, they're the people that are native here. Oh, so are we somewhere different, like... Well, we're underneath Yarnum. This place is underneath Yarnum. That's cool. Dweamer Society. I could just roll off here. There's a bag man down there, I think. What's a fuck from the rats? Shining coins. What's the point of the coins? Nothing? Um, it's like, it's like a way marker thing. Not really. You can throw them down and they, like, shine. So it's like, um, cookie crumbs or whatever. Okay. But you can use them to, like, communicate to people as well. In other games, you would, like, put down an item. If you wanted to give someone an item, you would either... Put, you would put down the item and then just shove it, cover it in, like, something shiny, so they would be like, oh, I could pick that up. Hmm. Or you could like use it to well, troll people. You could put 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 an item down, put a, a bunch of those stones down, wait for them to pick up the item, and then shoot them off the legs of a big bow <laughs> and kill them that way. Just depends on how much of a dickhead you are. True. Wait, where'd you go? Uh, ran out. Oh, there you are. Are right, you ready for your first boss, Dom? Hell yeah, let's do it. Your gonna first one, boss in the Chalice Dungeons. Gonna one-shot this motherfucker. 
You mind not stabbing my back, please? Undead giant. What the fuck? Right, first thoughts. No, it's if you that. continue, if you continue down here, there'll be like another lamp, and then I'll just you'll have to summon me again down here. Okay. Um, I'll run through my own chalice dungeon real quick to get to where you are. Okay. Layer two. Uh, the second one will be like another um, exclusive um, enemy type to the Chalice Engines. Okay. The Watchdog of the Old Gods. The Watchdog. Just get the shit out of me. <laughs> you did that right <laughs> as someone jumped out. <laughs> <laughs> It might take us a while to get through these chalice dungeons as well, because at some point I might need you to get, um, to start summoning you in as well. Oh, Christ. Because of, well, I've got the chalice dungeons to work, I have to reopen them and close them. So I, I will be progressing through them at the same time you will be. Fair that, that probably won't be, um, for a, a while, we have to worry about that sort of stuff. Yeah. Yo, they're climbing up the ladder. What the fuck? Got the Chikage is an overpowered weapon. Holy crap. The weapon I'm using on this character, I think, is the most overpowered weapon in the game. Oh, really? Yeah, it's the k katana, and it's, it's not. Blood thing is so overpowered. Oh, found the bag, man. Found a chest. Ritual blood. Now, hypothetically, could I level up, um, like, blood tinge and arcane and be everything at once, or no? Um, well, you could, but, you know, it will take you forever. <laughs> To get to the point where either of those will be like something you'd actually want to be using. Whoa, they just fucking ambushed me. That was creepy. Well, if I do that one thing, um, that chalice, like, cheat or whatever in the coming one hypothetically yeah. i could do that yeah and just become like level 544 max cap level and just fucking annihilate everything yeah if you want to do yeah i might fucking do that then much i basically am a god now What? I found um what well, the the enemy, the funny enemy I spoke about. The, don't progress oh yeah, you think yeah, good, good, good. That guy could have happened any better of a time because I just opened my own gold door in my own telephone. <laughs> I'm really excited for you to see this enemy on. Oh my god, I've spawned next to it. Oh shit. What if I just what if I just leave very carefully? You don't see me. Good. Where are you? I'm in a faraway land. <laughs> oh! God, I hate that ambush shit. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
<laughs> I heard, I heard the <laughs> <laughs> of them all spawn again. Oh, what the fuck? Hiya. <laughs> 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 I won't turn the call of you don't. <laughs> <laughs> I won't tell of this enemy dom. Yeah. And there's a little carriage. Look, look down there. It's fucking nothing. You don't see that dude? Oh, wait. Oh, it's Shrek. Now, don't kill him straight away, just watch him throw a bit. Alright. Just when you go down there. Go on. Oh, I'm going down. Oh, okay. You go on. What the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Wait, 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 wait. He rolls. The snake is track and he rolls. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Ew. And he can play with his corpse after as well. But for he's <laughs> yeah. he wears shoes though. <laughs> nice shoes. That's funny. Oh yeah, they're great. The, my favourite enemy, for sure. Not this bullshit again. This so has to be dumb. a... This has to be a Chalice Dungeon thing. This has never happened no, in the main game. No, it definitely happens everywhere. We just haven't encountered it. <laughs> we did it once before, but we haven't forgotten about it. Um, come through this area and has a big chest. Oh. So... Every chalice dungeon they This fucking guy did. <laughs> every every chalice dungeon after this will have like side rooms that have No, you could have done that when I couldn't find you. <laughs> yeah, I just remember. There's a That's fine. We could probably stop there for now. Um next time should we start Dark Souls or should we just continue and... Well it's up to you if you want to do the chalice dungeons, but we could do Dark Souls, it's up to you. Okay, we could probably start it, and if, it, if we ever want to just play Bloodborne again, we could just do the Chalice Dungeon. Yeah. It's interesting, though. Well, thank you. That's good, I'm glad we finally finished one of these fucking games. <laughs> I know, to I feel fair, like... When I, uh, oh, go ahead. I was going to say, like, initially when we were like, oh yeah, we'll play Bloodborne, I never thought we would actually play through Bloodborne. I thought, was, you know, when we just, oh yeah, we'll do that. You know, just something you bring up, but you never actually do. We know we actually played it, and we actually finished it. Good shit. I know, right? I know, right? We actually did a... Uh... Pretty good with it. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Yeah. Sweet. All right. Well, that's the conclusion of Bloodborne with Bailey. Thank you for watching and Godspeed. I should just be like, um, Souls professional. <laughs> <laughs> it's when you get spawned in to help with a boss. It's just above your name, Souls professional. <laughs> Humphrey the Wise. Do actually, there's a, there's a fun story on Elden Ring of, um, there's a boss I haven't seen any spoilers for because I don't want to be spoiled, but she's, I've heard she's unbelievably difficult, right? Like, truly, truly unbelievably difficult. The goddess of uh, rot or whatever. Yeah, and then there was some dickhead, and his name was Let Me Solo Her, and he was just wearing a pot on his head, and he <laughs> apparently, from the legends I've heard, absolutely destroyed her or something like that. <laughs> like, a, just a dude you can you can summon in called Let Me Solo Her, and he just completely dominates. <laughs> <laughs> and that dude's, like, now a living legend in the community. It's <laughs> <laughs> funny. It's like a dude wearing a, nothing but a pot on his head and dual katanas. <laughs>